Ooh. Oh, I can come. Ooh. I love the women. I love the ladies. I love the chicks. I love the tits, the ass, and the pussy. I don't do do. Do your fucking job. I just, I don't know, it's just, it's just, you know, we're putting something foreign into our bodies and we just don't know what's going to happen. Then again, I drink alcohol. You got a dick, I'll follow you. Yeah, after I can eat my fucking grundle hole. I, I basically bust in on her. I hate your fucking guts. I'll kick your ass, Lord. And fuck Bill Goldberg. I play games where you get back to death. Creepy sons of bitches. A colonizer. A lot of small ones. I had about motherfucking five, fifteen, uh, motherfucking eighty drinks tonight. I'm coming on your ass, Rick. I'm coming for that ass. <sighs> ha, ha, ha. <sighs> yeah. Everybody's kept coming in there. God, die. Are you ready? Someone take out my thingamajig. And by thingamajig, I mean wanker madoodle. And by wanker, Madoodle, I mean my pud. Yeah. I mean my freaking pud, brother. You Check are, the mic and make yeah. sure it sound right, boys. Yeah, you're tuned in to Monetize This, episode number 337. Seven, seven. The Boston Red Sox right now are destroying the fucking Tampa Ray Devil Rays. Good Lord. What is going on? 14 to 6. The Giants and the Dodgers. The Red Sox in Tampa Bay. AEW Rampage. WWE SmackDown. Monetize this 337. Leah, my wife, the Queen. Garguts, has he sent the belt back? I don't know. Does anybody? We're going to find out. Is Jake okay? We're going to find out. It sound right, boys. What's up, chat? You got about five seconds to give this thing over 69 likes. My wife is the queen. Can you take her crown tonight? Every dollar you donate. We're going to spin the wheel and find out who is the queen or king of the monetize this for the week on the Joe Cronin show. And in a minute, I'm going to go over to discord and I'm going to suck off Jesse. That's right. They're muted right now, but we'll be back to them in a second. Shout out to the chat. Melvin's wrestle chat. Go Braves. Oh God. Go Giants. Go Braves. What are you, JD? I like the Braves because I like to piss off everybody who I grew up with because I'm a dickhead. God, I hate those people. I'm going to root against the Patriots because uh, I just want to make everybody mad that I know, you know? Come on. <laughs> Zelina Vega or... Well, you know, Zelina Vega winning or Tony Storm winning, either way, people would have complained. Either way, people would have been all pissed off no matter what happened. All right, let's be honest. I also have a nice little conversation that I have with my former co-host earlier, Dead on Dave. We had a little uh, exchange earlier, recorded it, going to play it. Also, uh, got into some weird shit in the car today on my stream about being a cat salesman. And uh, that was weird. Someone in the chat said, "Try like, try to, how would you sell... Uh, JD a cat and I basically went into my sales pitch you know and I, I know it was weird because it was like basically saying like assuming that the person buying the cat was gonna fornicate with it and I know that that is very bizarre but 
listen, I knew my audience. If I was going to sell him a cat, I'm going to paint the picture of the cat, you know, getting off on him. Hey, Paul three, how you doing, man? Hey, Joe, I'm doing Whoa. pretty good, man. Um, Jesus. I got to say, I wasn't on last week. Because uh, you were... I was actually abducted. I was abducted by aliens, and I had a little green man in my ass. What the hell? <laughs> what kind of aliens were they? They were little green men, dude. There was like a couple of them in That's not nice to say about Japanese people, dude. Come on. Let's not. Let's not oh, do dude, that. dude, I didn't say yellow. Come on, come on. Oh. Um, so what did they look? How tall were they? I mean, they were, you said little, like, would you say three feet tall, little green men or, yeah, you know, they were, they were like, you know, like five, three, they, uh, oh. trolled, uh, they trolled some guy online named Joe Cronin. Hmm. They screamed and, uh, I think they went by the name of bullfrog. Actually. Oh, really? So they were, uh, they were autistic aliens. Right. Yeah. It's actually an entire alien race of, a retards douchebag in the closet pieces of shit named bullfrog. Oh my yeah. God. Well, that's uh, very Multiple. concerning. I'm concerned about this because, you know, I thought maybe, um, like, you know, I thought Earth was the only place we would have this sort of, I don't know, what would you call it, tardism? Maybe. No, no, no. Well, let me turn over. And what's up to the chat, by the way? The new donation link uh, that I, I worked on a lot of shit to fix. It took me uh, 30 minutes to do that. It's up pinned to the top of the chat or Super Chats are up. All that stuff's up. We're going to spin the wheel tonight. I'm going to try to uh, make it light for everybody a little bit. You know, we're going to see how long the show can go tonight. See how crazy we can get. I have a bottle of rum, courtesy of my wife. Bought me a bottle of rum because she wants to molest me. That's right. My wife wants to molest me. I want everybody to take, Ooh. just think about that. Get a that pen and paper. That wretched bitch. Yeah. Yeah, you, <laughs> shut up. Oh, you wretched God. bitch. Hold on. Oh, yeah. I was like, <laughs> You wretched bitch. You're like, oh my God, dude. That was See, I didn't want to just do Norm again. I like, I said it almost like real, like yeah. that wretched bitch. Oh, you got me going. I was like, oh, I know what he's talking about. It's <laughs> great. Oh yeah. I love it, dude. It's like, cause you've oh, done yeah. that shit a couple of times. I was expecting you to call back to right. it. You know? Did you, out. you know who I talked to earlier today? I talked to uh comedian, Derek Richards. <sighs> and uh, he was on before once before. Da- sure. Do you know Dave Landau in like, do you know a little Dave, bit, not much. Dave Landau was on Anthony Cumia's show for a while. No, I know, I know that. I don't know his comedy for shit. Though. Oh, okay. Like okay. I don't, I've never watched any of his comedy like that. I've watched yeah. him on shows plenty of times, but. Oh, okay, all right. Well, that's all I was kind of getting at, you know. Um, oh, so who's this guy though? I don't know him that I know of. Yeah, like I don't, I might. Yeah. Um, you were bringing up some other guy. That's what I was asking. Yeah. So I mean, I had Derek. Well, they're kind of friends. So I had Derek Richards on earlier today. Oh, okay. And the, the reason I had him on was because he was on Alex Jones yesterday or la- two days ago. So Derek Richards, uh-huh. this really sweet, you know, like I, I forget how old he is, like in his late 40s or 50s or something like that. He's a little bit older, a little polished, you know, good comedian. I really enjoy him. Um, he just got canceled off of the U.S. military something tour. Like they go over to Afghanistan and all these <laughs> other, you know, not now. They're not going there now. You know, they're fucking, but, you know, they were going all those places. <laughs> He was canceled for tweeting out things like the my pillow guy holding the pillow and then like Joe Biden in a bed and it, the insinuation of, you know, I don't know, you could you could mean anything, you know, it could mean who knows what that means is is going on. But uh, you know, all the all these different jokes and he got canceled off that tour for that and he's like I don't get it, you know, like they spent years doing that stuff to Trump and nobody got in trouble. Kathy Griffin did the cut his head off thing. Um, but it was just funny that, you know, he got canceled. I'm like, Derek Richards, this guy's like, he's like the guy I said, if I had like a winery and I wanted to have a comedian come over, you know, you wouldn't call like somebody who's just fucking filthy, you know, like me or somebody like, I'm not a comedian, but I mean, you wouldn't call somebody like who I like, like Tim Dillon or somebody like that. You know, you'd call like, you know, this guy in a suit tells these little sophisticated zingers and jokes that, you know, you get everybody over with. And, you know, he's a little bit like that. Um, and, yeah, in fact, and, and he got canceled. I just couldn't fucking believe I was like, you got to be kidding me. I seen him on Alex Jones. Alex was like, well, what the fuck did you do, Derek? And, um, yeah, so it was a good little sit down. He's going to be on the show again <laughs> this week. Uh, we're going to have Dave Landau back on the show, Stephen Crowder. Uh, and then Leah, I told Leah, I said, hey, you know, I talked to Stephen Crowder again, and then I talked to Dave Landau separately, and we got Derek Richards back on the show, and he got canceled, and he was on Alex Jones yesterday. And Leah was like, oh, great. 
so you're a right wing psycho. <laughs> you know, it's like, no, uh, just, I don't know why. I don't know. I, I love tra- it, dude. I've tried to be friends. With, so I, I'm friends with some left wing comedians, too. I don't know. They just they're not around. Uh, I don't know. No, but that is such a class. Like, that is just fucking hilarious. <laughs> that she said that to you. She like, goes, that you is fucking the Trump. fucking greatest thing ever, dude. And she goes, you fucking God Trump damn. supporter. I'm like, I'm not. A, I'm just fucking whatever. <laughs> And I'm pretty See, sure like she, she should be on air with this shit. <laughs> I know. Even, it's not even on air. She just needs to come on and be her. That was hilarious. And it was all fair that I like I'm ready to like I can almost see it. How funny it must have nothing, been. Nothing beats <laughs> nothing beats. Oh, my God. I'm so worried about Jake. And now Jesse's going to have eye surgery. Uh, I his eye surgery. Yeah, he's going to have uh, eye surgery. He's going to have his whole eye operated uh, on. What did the dogs fight back? Uh, like, oh I mean, god dude, yes i killed you. i forgot about that oh fuck that's another one that she does dude i'm telling you i know i think we talked about it last week <sighs> but she does this to me all the time where she so says this dry insane joke and i oh, start fucking yeah, dude, losing that's it the best. and i'm like where is this on the because she would say that on a show she's good for i'm con- <laughs> I, i'm convinced she's good for one or th- to three savage comments on a show when she doesn't really speak, but out of nowhere, after 30 minutes of silence, she'll be like, yeah, I hope they bleed to death. And you just start laughing. Well, like, yeah, she had to. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's interesting. That's all the timing, though. Like, it's still going to be like that, ed- like the abrasive, like, oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, just like something. Sim- <laughs> Speaking of, yeah. fucking, I, was, I didn't mean that other fuck. <laughs> Does she do that in real life to yeah. you, Joe? What do you mean? Wait, oh, yeah. What do you mean? So like like if you're having like a heart what? attack for real and you're like, Oh, I'm dying oh, and shit. she's like, Oh, oh, you want me to call the hospital or the, the ambulance? But she just no, like joking sort around. Of. That could be like nonchalantly. Sort of, yes. Yeah. Yeah. She'll either do that, depending on how serious it is, but then or the other thing would be she would say, Go to the hospital. <laughs> you know, like if I was like, Oh, I don't feel I feel like something's wrong. Go to the hospital. Help yourself, pretty yeah, much. Like you're, yeah, exactly. Like, yeah, I'm not. I will test you're annoying your, uh, cause if you. Because if it's bad enough, you'll always go to the hospital. If it's like, if you're right. feeling that fucked up. Like, it's always that little test. Like, well, but if it's that bad, I I'm not that. going to the fucking I need, hospital I for need this. To, I need to be with yeah. that type of person. If I was with somebody who was like, oh my God, really? What's What do you think is. Like, can you imagine? My the, God, the, you would manifest your own fucking. <laughs> my own fucking issues and diseases and my, shit. You'd my be ne- a hypochondriac and a fucking. My neurosis, oh my, my neurosis would take would <laughs> take over our lives. I mean, like, Every other week, you're already like, "Oh, I got this going on. I wonder if it's this shit." Oh, it's reading like whatever, and it's like, "Oh my, you're right." If somebody was there, like fucking aiding that kind of shit, like the pattern, those patterns. Oh my god, yeah, be all fucked up. I'd be fucked, bro. Oh. I'd be dead. I'd be dead by like next There'd week. There'd be nothing on the scans for a while, but you'd be so neurotic about it after a couple, of, you know, two, three years of just hardcore with it. All these scans start showing all kinds of shit, and you just made it all happen. <laughs> and your partner's over there, like, I don't know how it. It just all happened suddenly. Check this out. Speaking of neurosis, look at this uh, dark game I played the other day. Ugh. Oh, yeah. McLaren is oh, looking right. for the perfect landing oh, here. No. Oh. oh, he just missed on the first throw. Just wide outside the bracket. But in the triple, he landed. Look at this. Oh, far off on that shot there was. Oh, my God. What a fucking miss of a shot it was. Completely <laughs> off the board. You ever heard a dark game? Remember we talked about this sec- six or seven years ago on uh, Monetize This about how dark, I'm not sure what you're talking about what. just dark games are fucking crazy. You ever hear the guys? Call- I never we, been to any or seen any. Or we went over. Shit. We we played them on Monetize This a long time ago. They're insane, dude. There's like a crowd, and the guy will be like, "Oh, he just missed it with that one." And it's like they're like nuts, bro. They're calling it like more, more than oh, pro. Oh, wrestling. you mean okay? <laughs> yeah, they're better than pro wrestling. <laughs> oh shit, it's crazy, like dude. Like the sh- yeah, they, they they get into it oh, better yeah. than the wrestling commentary. Like it's unbelievable. Like it's like like watch this. Listen, just listen to this. This is a new one. Oh, they're playing stupid music over the call. That's fucking bullshit. Fuck that. What? All right, I thought that was. Jesus. Yeah, yeah, it's it, uh, it, it's yeah, you got to see. They got to get something where you can't hear that because it's it's wild, dude. The announcers are just nuts. Like I I want to call darts. Like at this point, like the way these guys sound. My goodness. Listen to this. Oh. Phil really should switch. 
Feel really oh. sure. Well, no, he shouldn't. He should just go in at 180. It's a single 20. There is no finish. Dude, do you hear that? The people fucking calling it. They got an announcer calling it, and then you got an commentators on top of it. Just fucking insane. Shit's nuts. Oh my god, Jake DeMarco's here. Shit's nuts. Oh my god, he's alive. <laughs> Jake. Oh my god, he's alive. Cheers. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Play my night was well, like whatever, dude. That Play his theme song. Better. Play his Even fucking if it theme still song. sucks, you still made it better. Play his theme song. Play his theme song. Where is it? Big Mac truck uh, in this little garage. The ambulance. Uh, we need an ambulance down. I don't put it. Yeah, give me a heartbeat. I don't cook. I don't <laughs> clean. But let me tell you, I got this ring. Gobble me, swallow me, drip. I'm sorry, that's not his Just music. Fucking Christ. That's not his music. I don't know what that is. Hey, to do to him and like I Joe said, it changed quick. Swallow me. That's oh. right. Whoa. We need a uh, nowadays hey. high school. Did you enjoy Rush that rant? Deal. I don't know what I was doing the other dude. I was. I didn't even know I did that. That was hilarious, but that oh. killed me. Just about for like the sixth time this week. But hey, baby, you're a hard one to get a hold of. I think I talked to your daughter more than I talked to you. But <clears throat> yeah, I missed everything she, you she, said because of her. She had me dying laughing, though. She was hilarious. I don't remember everything she said. I didn't get to. I was so busy. I didn't even read it over. But I was like, I, by the way, I was waking up as she was telling me things you were saying to her. Yeah. She was like, she's like, I'm so mad at dad. He's, I'm trying to wake him up. He's not waking him up. I was like, well, tell him Jake said to wake him up. That's good. Get him up. And she kept. I was like, so I'm guessing this is Brenna then. And she's like, you're a stalker. You know my name. It was hilarious. Like, <laughs> I'm like, you don't recognize me. And then she kind of like put two and two together. And uh, she showed me a video of her getting home from school, being afraid of a bug. That was hilarious. And, uh, she was a riot. <laughs> oh, so. she had it on the phone and she showed it to you. Yeah. How the oh, fuck yeah. did she, you figure that out? I. She's quite technically savvy, so it was hilarious. But what the God, hell? I've missed everybody. It's been uh, a rough Damn. couple of weeks. It sucked. But yeah. uh, here I am. I came home to a big box, and lo and behold, it was from Shell. Right. And I got oh, a oh. brand new banana light you got it, you, there, wow. as well as some custom <laughs> merch that says stay sexy with my face on it. You know, oh, so my God. Shell. She, she, got me this fit great all that merch in her box. She, she did indeed. Her box came packed. I'm telling you what. Big box. Oh, it's awesome. yeah. super tight, though. Mm. Amazingly Was tight. Was there like a bow and everything around? Like, Oh, candies. it had more than just a bow. Just a I mean, this thing came from Canada, so it was it was legit. Oh, so yeah. Oh, yeah. It had like drug right, sniffing babe. dogs just on it, you know. It's oh, it, it had more than just that. <laughs> I mean, they had to pass this thing through. I even got oh, some, uh, hold on, where is it? I got some uh, Christopher Maloney porn. Not joking. <laughs> so I'm excited about that. Um, <laughs> there's a few other treats what? for misses the in there. Like I said, I got some Stay Sexy Great. merch. And Sith Negan also saved my life by paying one of my medical bills for my birthday. So thank oh. you to him for keeping oh. me alive. So. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. it, is, it has been uh, quite Great. quite the interesting time, but I, I've, I've not even been on. I just got home. So it was like, hey, you guys, are let's do this. I'm going to surprise him. Dude, Sith Negan's oh, fucking yeah. awesome, man. He's literally like it's a lot of people like don't I do this, that and the other. And there's been a lot of cool people, but it, it's like. You can tell by the timing of shit that they do. Plus, we've I've oh, talked to him a couple of times, but not much. Like you could just tell this guy's in it for the right reason. He like he mm. cares about everyone involved with this so much. Ab you know, absolutely, really cool. he genuinely, you know, always you know makes makes you feel home. That's for sure. But so. I thought you know you didn't yeah. you didn't end up getting the bell. I thought Gargot said he sent it again. I don't have it yet. Maybe he should have sent it in Shell's did, box. If it got there quicker, yeah. he sent it to Canada, then I, back to you. Should have, yeah, we should have packed it right in. Oh my so. God, <laughs> Jesus! He still hasn't. I missed. It? I missed Probably everybody did. though. Yeah. I've not even been on Twitter in ages. I mean, part of my problem was not originally when I was in Yale. I was too close to the radiology department, so I had no service. And then by the time I got to Mid State, forget it. I didn't have my phone, and they just kind of took me and rushed me into things. So I was kind of dealing with a lot of that stuff. And then I got a ton of anxiety just towards you know the last two days worrying about you know not responding to people i don't want to miss anybody so i eventually i'll get back to everybody but know that i miss everyone and i appreciate the get well messages the birthday messages all of it you guys have been incredibly kind and so helpful and i've seen all of your you know comments for sure i'm sorry i haven't been able to reply to everything but God knows that you have all gotten me through. So your support means everything. I love you all. And you, people are doing good. Let's you could party. be dead. You could be dead. Like, too, bro. Right? I mean, that's it's crazy. Right. Like they caught that shit. You had been dead. Yeah. So I mean, quick rundown. I I 
tend to aspirate vomit every now and again because I vomit so often. So you end up getting in your lungs. And I've had that that pneumonia from what a dozen times at this point. So me coughing up blood, we even joked about it on there. It's not like a brand new thing. You've seen me do it a ton. But this time I had such horrific pain in my chest that continually got worse. Yale sent me home on three antibiotics. I now know what CM Punk meant about shitting his pants in the ring. I will bring that up in a bit. It's a good story. But uh, <laughs> they basically, how they Z-packed him to death, that's what they did to me. Oh. They, I was on sulfameth, doxycycline, um, amoxiclav, amoxicillin, and one other. So as much as I couldn't even eat, I'm on all of Just these Just stay the and- fuck away from clindamycin. Well, it actually, <laughs> long story short, I was vomiting at one point, and, and it looked like the scene from Dumb and Dumber where they got the chocolate Hershey's all over the bathroom. Yeah. Like, no, I had you don't want new, that, dude. Uh, yeah, I had to get a new shower curtain. Clint, this, this thing well, no, that's when the mice, and like, that's what happened with my mom, and then she almost died. They had yeah. to give her like antibiotics that almost killed her to so, save her from the other from, shit. It was like she, it was amazing. Not eating. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, the myosin, that's really what it was from. It's like that one eats all your gut bacteria. It will just destroy yeah, you. Yeah. That's why you and, have to take uh, the, 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 the doxycycline. The you named the ones you're on right now is they're in good doses. Those are great. Those are the ones because it was they're safer though, to take in long that. term. You know, it is. Yeah, but you can take this at a hardcore rate, whereas like. That clindamycin, if you do like three rounds of that, you're fucking, you could, you know what I mean? You, you, you're, you're now with COVID, you could, your immune system will be shit. You have no gut health. Yeah, you, no that's kidding. why that one, like, that's why unless that one means, yeah. women's probiotic. Ooh, you know, gotta, gotta well, they that like has to higher than men's. Like, so. Women's probiotic. Oh, hey, fuck yeah, dude. Yeah. Grow that hair <laughs> out. Pico might be onto something, and thank you, funny. Trey. But it's it, yeah, the belt might be in uh if it's not in the pawn shop, then Gargots has it at his fruit stand. We will find it though. So I, well, dude, I, I, I'm convinced. convinced it. I'm yeah, convinced exactly. that he went to the pawn shop at least twice. I'm, you know I didn't what it feel is? any better, and I just continually was in a ton of pain. And and finally, my doctor's ah, like, "Hey, let's let's do this test, that test. All right, you don't look good." And my my chest started to hurt worse, and then I couldn't breathe. And every time I breathed in, it just was like this sharp needle in my lungs. And I'm like, all right, yeah. something's worsening. Mm. I went back to the hospital, and they're like, Yale let you out like this? I'm like, yeah. So they literally grabbed me by the wrist and ran me to CAT scan. They put an IV in while I was laying in CAT scan, and they they scanned me quick, and they're like, oh, you don't have – well, you have pneumonia, but you are, it's it's a blood clot headed to your lungs – or from your lungs to your heart. So we, we have to go ahead and you know treat this as emergent. They get me into the like they're trying to get me in the ICU Damn. at that point, and that's when they do the echocardiogram because the CAT scan showed strain in my heart. They're giving me nitrous. All the, yeah, it's just a, a total mess, and that's when the cardiovascular surgeon comes in. They're th- they're talking about flying me out to Hartford at that point because they might have to put a stint in Ooh. and send me to the cardiac cath lab. Like they're scaring the shit out of you for all. Why this the stuff. fuck couldn't they do that where uh, you were at? Damn. And I guess their radiology department didn't have enough for IR for their interventional radiology to handle it. So, Jeez. so all of these things are going on. And then the echocardiogram showed that it was less strained from the way the clot shifted. So they were able to uh, put in like an IJ line directly and target the clots that way. So I spent a good amount of time inverted on heparin <laughs> and Jeez. basically just kind of stayed that way for a while. So pretty much sedated and chilling wasn't wasn't fun cardiovascular surgeon was like if you didn't get to the hospital when you did when when they caught it you had about four hours till you died so jesus Damn. good to know glad well, i uh glad i glad i jake I, I think I got about two lives left out of nine big badass that's for sure jake would you like to see right. the video of uh my daughter freaking out yes please everyone you? needs to see this because it's absolutely please. hilarious watch this this is her coming to the door here it is <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ! It wasn't a spider. It was... You see that? What? She reached for the door handle, and that stink bug was on his head. <laughs> the best thing. The oh, dream scared away bug. all insects. The yeah. mile. Yeah, that the, thing was not having it. The funniest thing was how she comes up the porch like la di da, enjoying life. Like she's happy. Oh, see, I missed all that. I just hear a scream. It's fucking a nightmare, man. She's walking up. See that what happened. She's walking up like all happy and then just like, I mean, right out of a horror movie or something like that. Like right here, she's super happy. She's like, yeah, just having a good day. This is great. I like. Can you see it now? You can't uh, see my video? I can see it. Dude, I, I think I'm clicking oh. on the wrong shit. That's the now. <laughs> oh, okay. We'll see if I can see it. Just, Finding it was the first. She, po- no, nah, I can't see shit, man. It doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan and Paul got it. 
Jesse's yeah. a little behind, but we'll get there. <laughs> I don't know, bro. That killed me, though. Yeah, I was dying laughing. And then she sent that audio clip, I think, by mistake the first time. Mm-hmm. And it just goes, Arr! like that. And Danny and I were dying laughing because it reminded me of the, uh, the, the mummy voice that got recreated. Yeah. Yeah, they're like, oh, you know, we spent all this money to recreate the, the mummy's larynx so we could hear what his voice would sound like. And it's just, oh! And that's all. <laughs> it, all this technology, all this money spent, all these scientists, MRIs recreating, and all you get is, oh! And that's oh, it. we so, always right. get it done. Ah, oh, ah! Oh, that's what it sounded like the lady from the Patriots thing yes, years ago. Yes. Who's going to win the Super Bowl? Ah! Oh, the Patriots! Or oh, whatever the. <laughs> Oh, we always get it done. We always get it done. Super Bowl 32. Or whatever the fuck. 42 it was, I think, actually. Uh, donation from John, Brian McCarron. going to dynamite in Boston a few weeks? Uh, am I going to dynamite? Why the fuck was that? Why didn't the regular alert play? That's weird. I might have to fix it. Oh, wait. Oh, no, I'm not going to dynamite. <laughs> Oh, this is a great name. Hey, have you guys ever watched any Russian slap fighting videos? It's a Hell good yeah. time. Yeah. Welcome back, Jake. <laughs> I'm over them myself. How kind of fetish is that? It's awful, dude. I, I think it's dumb. I just want to fight. But if for, for a little bit, it is entertaining. It is kind of crazy. Shardy Janetti, thank you. Yeah. Shardy. Joe, what, what the fuck's wrong with you, dude? You're just going to gloss over you're not going to dynamite? <laughs> Boston? Yeah, you know, last yeah, time right they now. gave me a press pass and I felt cool. This time I would just be buying a ticket like a civilian. I'm not downgrading myself to that level. Sorry. <laughs> so you're you're oh, above you're above that. You're yes. above just it's all right. We got bigger fish That's to fry. You know, we, fuck dynamite. We Jake's gonna, not gonna die tonight. <laughs> tonight. So many. Tonight, so, <laughs> what are you just shit? Why are you? Shit I said on not. Uh, you're in the clear at least for now until you know God knows what yeah. else. Life's trying to get us, dude. It's like watch out for lightning and shit where there's like clear skies well here i am i'm the only one getting hit (laughs) i'm trying to i i I checked in with your mom she reached out to me to see how i was feeling i was worried about you so we were inquiring about each other because you were having surgery and then at least i'm gonna be just eating myself to death (laughs) <laughs> hey, I, you know, I, I wish I could be at that level. And all Leah cared but, about was the dogs getting. Oh, it's even. not good, man. Fuck I know that that, that line was great too. Oh, Leah, that that perfect timing sense of humor. That's what killed me. Is yeah, like I right. couldn't believe it. Like that's I was right. like, what? What the Bless. fuck? I'm like, I'm so worried about Jesse. Like he could go blind. Like from this, and he's gonna have his eyes operated on. And she goes, "Would the dogs fight back?" <laughs> In that in that dry fucking voice, dude, and I just went <laughs> uh, <laughs> like and I fucking I went from being kind of worried and upset for a second to literally busting out laughing, and be like, "Why isn't that recorded? Why can't Jesse hear that?" Exactly. I wanted you to hear it so bad. It was well, oh even the, even the story's great, but oh yeah, God. it's like that's two solid lines tonight. You mentioned where it's like, man, and that's well, just you and her. Just, oh that's my God, amazing. die. So. Like, that fucking, oh my God, <laughs> not, not to make it like, I'm not trying to make it about myself, but I, I have the same kind of feeling you do, Joe, with, with <laughs> Bailey's clip, talking about women's wrestling. And at the end, I just, I love that so much. It's just like, I liked him better when he was fat. Like that, like, oh, oh yeah. God, I cracked up so hard. Yes, JB did it too. He did the same thing at the end of that clip of me and him. Yeah. I don't so think he's, good. I don't think he's coming back, but <laughs> anymore, I'm not sure. But we did have fun while he was here. Um, that was hilarious. And then he sent me some really funny shit. He sent me, uh, I mean, I don't think he's coming on tonight. I think he's coming 